Hey, what's up, crew? Today, we're going to talk about potting potatoes. I know, you're excited. You go, wait, Mr. Fernie, we're going to learn how to grow pot potatoes? No, we're not going to learn how to grow pot potatoes. We're going to learn how to grow potatoes in a pot. Because why not grow your own food and stop buying all that crap from the store? I hear you say, well, that's what I'm here for. So let's take you through just some simple ideas that you could put in your brain stem to see how you can grow your own potatoes year round. And especially if you like little potatoes. So here's what you do. Go get yourself a pot from Walmart. Get two of them. In fact, if you got one of these crafty little pots like this, and I want you to cut four big holes in it. Go ahead, cut Big old windows in the bottom of that thing. Okay, cut four of them, leave a little space in the middle. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So, if we have our pot in our bucket here, and uh, don't don't judge me too much on this camera stuff, guys. You know what I'm talking about? You wanna see my face? I do too. All right, so here we are. You got your pot, right? Just like this. You're gonna draw a window down here like this, a big window like that. Okay, you're gonna do that four times all the way around this thing. Do it again. Cut you four of those windows like that. Then again, when you've got your cut windows in your pot and you've got another one that you haven't cut at all, you're gonna put the cut window one inside the whole one. Okay, and I say, why, why Mr. Funny, am I cutting? pots and I'm putting one inside the other oh my goodness it just don't make no sense well let me tell you what you got to do after that so once you got your two pots put together one inside the other I'll show you a final product of what this looks like okay once you got the whole one and you got the one with the windows inside of it you're gonna put some dirt in the bottom of it I'll give you a couple layers okay dirt in the bottom of the pot and then you're gonna take some potatoes now let me show you you can buy store-bought ones you can get your own ones but you're gonna get some potatoes, similar to this, maybe a little smaller. If you can find the smaller ones, if you like red potatoes, those work the best. But these ones are good too. You take some of these potatoes and you leave them in the dark, right over there on our shelves. They're gonna be, uh, they're gonna be sitting in the nighttime. You can see them right there. Let me see. Whoop, 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 whoop. Don't mind them. There they are. They're right over there next to the, next to the Gatorade. They're right there. <laughs> okay. They sit there in the dark for a while. Okay. They can be on the garage. It's cool. They sit in the dark. And then they start to grow shoots. They start to grow sprouts like that, right? And you stick them in the in the dirt with a little bit of the sprout just sticking up just a little bit. Just cover it up just a little bit like that. Right there. Okay? And then you let those shoots grow. You stick them in a south-facing window and uh, in your pot like that. And they'll start to grow. Right? And once they grow, then you add more dirt. And you keep adding dirt. And you keep adding dirt until the, the dirt is up to the level of the pot, the top part right there. Right there, you see what I'm talking about? Yeah. Once the, once the dirt gets up there, you let the potatoes grow, and they'll grow over the pot. And you keep watering them, give them about an inch, inch in the water a week, okay? And those, those uh, potatoes will actually start to grow potatoes themselves. I know, it's crazy. That's how you make potatoes, right? And so now you go, well, why do I have two pots? What's the purpose of the second pot? Ah, in there lies the magic, okay? Because now you take the one that's got the windows in it, and you pull that bad boy out, like, out, of, out of the out of the other one, and now you can see all the potatoes in the side of the of the one with the potatoes in it. So you just go in and you grab a few potatoes and you stick it back in there, and you don't harm the plants, and you can keep growing. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Now these poor saps right here are pretty new, okay? And so they don't have really big potatoes growing on the bottom of them, but this is the exact same thing I was telling you about. See, I got two of the buckets right here. This inside one has got big windows cut in it in the side of it, all down there, okay? And there's four of them, all the way around in there. And I put four spuds in there and I filled it up with dirt as the spuds grew up, okay? And so now they're pretty thick vines here. And in about, I don't know, a couple of months, this thing will get to like this tall, right? You guys see that? Boom, like that tall. And the leaves will start to wilt and they'll start to go brown. And then once they fall over, you kind of pull them out and leave them in the dirt for a little bit. Don't wash them off. Let the dirt harden on them. And then you have fresh potatoes right in your own house. You can grow them year round, okay? One thing I did notice about this whole project though when I did it, let me show you back over here. Don't mind the mess, guys. You know, we got it. We got a messy garage. In the bucket, right? In both buckets, if you pour water in this and there's no drainage holes, this one has a little bit in the bottom right there. You can see this hole, but sometimes those get covered up. I had to drill holes in the side of this. I drilled it all the way through. And you might be able to see that in the red one. I don't know if you can. Don't mind the mess, guys. Don't mind the mess. 
Right, yeah, you can see the hole right there. See that? I had to drill it in the side just to help with drainage. Otherwise, the uh, bottom of the potatoes just sit there in water, and then they get all rotten and mildewy, and that's no good, no bueno. All right, so here you go. That is how to grow pot potatoes. Mm, get you some. Love y'all. Have a great day.